The current mental health climate revolves around hashtags and awareness campaigns. And although this is extremely important, I'm sure we can all agree that it's not enough. We've come so far in our ability to share stories and to talk about how we feel, but it's time to take the next step forward in education. Who's excited this morning? <laughs> so the first thing we need to really recognize is that everyone has a yearning to belong, to be loved and to be understood. Once we're open about these emotional needs that bind us, talking about mental health is so much easier and can be such a beautiful thing. 10 years ago, I was diagnosed with clinical depression and generalized anxiety disorder. Depression is a feeling in the moment that everything is meaningless and hopeless, but the big thing with depression is that it takes away your sense of future. So my future was black, my present was black, but what I discovered was there was still that nine-year-old Scott who wondered about the world. There were still years of questioning within me. Now it doesn't matter where you are in your mental health journey. We all need tools, strategies, and perspectives to help create and maintain our mental health. This means we need to be open to new ideas, stories, and teachings that educate us and inspire us. Let's widen our horizon. That's what we need to do. We must teach one another how to embrace challenges, how to view hardship as learning opportunities, and how to see the strength within ourselves. One of the things that I'm inviting people to think about is that people are not perfect the way they are. It's the imperfection that holds all beauty. It's recognizing that we are imperfect, but having an action plan for self-improvement. We must strive to be better, to learn, to adapt, and to grow get up every morning to become better than we were yesterday. This is how we normalize this conversation about mental health at home, at work, at school, and everywhere in between. Let's embrace imperfection and have an honest dialogue about mental health and what it means for each and every one of us. Let's express ourselves.